Let me break this down and then I'm going to tell you about what Sony has done to actually acknowledge that there's a problem and fix it. First off, we need to understand what the problem is. Now, many people have heard this story before, that the liquid metal that cools the APU, that's the main processing chip on your PlayStation 5, has leaked out through the pad that is designed to keep it in place. Now that may be true for a couple people. It was later revealed that in both cases, the user probably had actually abused the system by either taking it apart ahead of time so it wasn't sealed up properly afterwards, or had dropped it and mishandled it. That doesn't mean that there's a problem with every PlayStation 5. But there are a number of documented cases of what we consider a dry APU. Now, let me explain the dry APU a little bit better. The PlayStation 5 uses liquid metal to transfer the heat from the APU to the cooler. And that provides a better heat transfer than using traditional thermal paste. And with system temperatures at an all-time high in this generation, that's really important in keeping your system cool and happy. 